Hey everybody, Chuck Holton here with your daily update from Jerusalem. Let's talk about what's going on in the war today. The operation in the West Bank is expanding. It's already the largest operation in the last 22 years. And you know, if you're old enough to remember the second intifada, which happened between 2000 and 2005, uh, you'll remember that one of the things that marked that period of violence was the incredible number of suicide bombings and car bombings that happened back then. Well, uh, the worst month of the second intifada, uh, you saw 13 suicide and car bombings in that one month. They call that Black March. It was March 2002. And I have to just say, in the last five days, I'm sorry, in the last three days, the IDF has thwarted or Fortunately, they missed out on uh, five car bomb attacks in the West Bank. So two of them actually went off at a gas station, but they didn't kill anybody. And one was found today and detonated by the IDF. Two others were found trying to get into Jerusalem uh, in order to blow up in downtown Jerusalem, right where I'm standing. And so uh, this is a increasing concern. We also had the shooting that I mentioned yesterday. And so that's that's huge. One other thing that we're seeing today is that the uh, Hamas terrorists have released a video that shows videos of all six of the hostages who were just murdered in cold blood. And uh, they said at the end of the video that they will be showing their farewell messages very soon. Uh, what that means is they're engaging in psychological terror on the Israelis. And in some sense, it's working because you've seen tremendous number of protests today all around Israel. They shut down the airport for a time. Uh, the, the labor unions went on strike. And this is all a bunch of very naive people who think that by surrendering to Hamas, they'll be able to get their hostages back and uh, not have more hostages taken later. Uh, Benjamin Netanyahu is staunchly against that. And so we'll see where this fight ends. That's all I got for today. We'll see you later. Make sure you like and subscribe to the podcast.